welcome to Stationary at Four. I have lost my voice, and of course this is the most appropriate time to be recording, <laughs> but I couldn't contain my excitement. It's, um, it's December, it's Christmas time, and uh, I've lost my voice because I we just had our company Christmas party, and it was a blast and a lot of fun. Um, and there I go talking about work, and obviously I love where I work. What I really wanted to share today was this cool thing that I bought, and uh, I had meant to do this video a few days ago. Even though I'm late, I still wanted to share it, and I think it's a really cool thing, and I ended up picking up the Diamine Ink Vent Calendar. Now this is the 2022 version. I don't know if you can see that a little bit better. It's an advent calendar, but with Diamine inks. And I just thought it was really cool. Um, so yes, I've cracked open the first couple of days, but I thought it'd be really neat to uh, crack open today, technically yesterday's. I'm already a couple of days behind and show you guys some of the cool inks that are in here. The Diamine Ink Vent calendar for 2022 is absolutely gorgeous. It's a nice big box. It's a fairly decent sized box. I can't even fit it all into the picture frame or the, uh, the video frame here. And the intent, as I mentioned, there is uh, 24 days, 25 days of inks, uh, diamine inks. And these are crafted inks from diamine that are catered towards the holiday season. And so you can pick one of these up. I believe they're still available um, from places like uh, Reed Stationers. Uh, this is where I picked it up and they retail for 120 Canadian dollars, give or take. It's gorgeous, it's my first time doing this. Uh, I've heard of them for the last couple of years. Diamine putting out these uh, Inkvent calendars. And so I was very excited to do it. My wife and I uh, were pretty stoked with respect to when this year's was announced and the fact that it was very easily and readily available. And so there's 25 days, uh, it's a standard advent calendar and uh, I've already opened up two days. And the cool thing about these here is that you get little, little vials of ink. And these I believe are 12 milliliter bottles of ink. And so there's quite a bit of ink in here, enough for you and a partner or you and yourself for many inks to share for quite some time. So very, very beautiful. Day one was bliss. Day two was Yule Log. So day one, day two, and now I'm gonna open up day three right here. Open. and it looks like it's uh, something called Solar Storm, which looks kind of like a purple, a dark purple, but we'll take a look here. 24, 12 milliliter bottles, one thirty milliliter bottle. And what I've been doing is I've been using a uh, calligraphy nib just to mess around with the inks and give it a try. So just peeling off the plastic. This is day one, Bliss. Day two, Ulog. And I'm just using a Rhodia notepad. Uh, and, and this is day three, which is a solar storm. Looks like a beautiful purple. Give it a little shake. These are tiny little bottles, and they're plastic bottles. Nothing too fancy with respect to the actual bottle itself, but I'll just dip this in. It's a nice, really dark black purple, it would seem.
beautiful. Let me zoom in so you guys can see that. Yeah. And there you all go. This is day three. Now, as I said, I am a couple days behind, so I might as well crack open day four here. Pull back the advent calendar. And day four is way down here. Like a beautiful beautiful green spruce. I do wish there was a bit more of a sustainable way to package these inks. So this is the spruce. Expecting that. Could be the uh, calligraphy net here. No, it's actually just very much so the, the ink itself. <clears throat> The ink is uh, very wet here, so I'm curious to see how this dries. There we go. I'm starting to get a little bit of character in that green. Like a dark green, yeah. Very dark green. Uh, black. Black green? Black when it's really wet. Thanks very much for joining me today. I hope you have a wonderful day. And there should be one more, maybe two more videos before December 25th. But just in case, I wish you all a happy holiday season. Take care and bye for now.